Philosophers and theologians have pondered for thousands of years. Does everything happen for a reason? Or are some things left to chance? If not for the most improbable of accidents 65 million years ago, there would be no philosophers or theologians to ponder these questions. An asteroid six miles wide that had been traversing the galaxy for four billion years slammed into the Earth at 50,000 miles per hour. Had it hit minutes earlier, it would have landed harmlessly in the Atlantic Ocean. Minutes later, it would have landed in the Pacific. But it didn't. It hit the Yucatan Peninsula, superheating the atmosphere and sending up an impact plume that would block out the sun for decades, wiping out three quarters of all species on Earth, marking the end of the dinosaurs, and making way for the rise of mammals. And if not for a similarly improbable collision, you might not be you. Just one sperm out of 100 million contenders fertilizes each egg, setting in motion an individual human life. And with two to the 23rd possible chromosome combinations coming from dad, and two to the 23rd possible combinations coming from mom, your unique chromosomal makeup is a one in 70 trillion chance. I'm Sean B. Carroll. Learn about the mother of all accidents and the accident of all mothers and much more in my new book, A Series of Fortunate Events, Chance and the Making of the Planet, Life, and You.